Hello everyone, my project name is Automation of Milk Processing in Dairy Field using PLC and HMI. The main objective of the project is to control and monitor the pasteurization and homogenization process of milk. What is the necessity of automation? Automation decreases the human work and prevents from human error. Due to this, it increases safety, it increases the product quality, uh, it increases the product economy uh, because we don't have to spend money on workers and also the product are reliable what is pasteurization pasteurization is a heat treatment process that destroys pathogen microorganisms uh, in certain food and beverages the treatment also destroys the most of the microorganisms that causes spoilage and so prolongs the storage time of the food what is the necessity of uh, pasteurization uh, we all co consume milk products so common types uh, we know that common types of uh, bacteria found in the mil uh, raw milk are campylobacter salmonella e coil listra these microorganisms can regenerate very quickly by fusing with one another and due to this uh, uh, due to this by drinking the raw milk hundreds of people get sick from uh, drinking raw milk this type of, uh, of broken products are really dangerous to infant young children the elderly and a weakened immunity system uh, uh, human beings so pasteurization is a very necessary project uh, process homogenization uh, is the uh, process of making a product completely uniform in terms of pa uh, particle or global size the homogenization process which is used in dairy field uh, is the physical process of breaking down the fat molecules in milk uh, so they can uh, stay integrated rather than separating as cream nothing is take, uh, is added to the milk or taken uh, out of the milk now i will show you the block diagram of a uh, project this is the general block diagram of a So first of all, we are opening the TIA portal version 16. After opening this, we are going to open the project file that we have created recently. So opening it. Now we are going to first check what are the devices and panels used here, processes. So there are one PLC and two HMI screens. The connection look like this. Now we are going to check the programming of PLC. In this we are first going to check the main, which is which will look like this in this main program the whole process is in the cycle uh, or uh, automation are included in that first is raw milk storage tank in this the raw milk collector from various areas are stored then the conversion and mapping then heat exchanger one heat exchanger two after that pasteurized milk storage tank then conveyor so first of all we are go to we go to conversion and mapping so this is the actual program of conversion and mapping this is for heat exchanger one and this is for heat exchanger two now this is raw milk storage tank program which we are going to see now 
this is it it looks like this this is on a control of tank then it is going to hit exchanger one in hit exchanger one this is program for it in which various timers and controllers are used I will hit exchanger two. Similar process is done. After that, pasture has melted. Go to the storage tank. This is a program. Or that then the finally pasteurized milk is filled in the bottles which are on the conveyor so for the conveyor this is the pro program this is the program for conveyor now these are the two cyclic interrupts we are using for heat exchanger one and two, which includes all processes in heat exchanger. This is two and this is one. Actually. Now we go to HMI. In HMI, we are using screens to see the content, which is going to happen in the actual pasteurization process so this is main first raw milk storage tank this is heat exchanger one this is heat exchanger two and this is pasteurized milk storage tank now we go to the hmi2 in which the whole process is included in single screen so this is the total simulation screen this is total program in this first when the set point is given to this the wall gets open and tank starts to fill then it goes to economizer and hit exchanger one then it goes to hit exchanger two then it gets emulsified and then the pasteurized milk is stored in the storage tank and finally when bottles are bottles are filled using this pasteurized milk now we go to the simulation so first for this we are going to main block of programming of plc in this way first go to simulation is getting compiled and after compilation it can be viewed this is we are going to load to simulation window 
now this change to start module for action then the our module will start now we are going to monitor it using monitor button now we go to the hmi2 this is also simulated it is getting compiled here it is getting compiled after compilation simulation will start the connection is established between hmi and plc when we give set point here and set a 20 the level will increase and here we go 50 let's now let's select here set point is given uh, 70 degrees celsius and here 40 degrees celsius or consider 20 degrees the process will be done now now we this is the actual program then we will stop simulation terminate it then again go to main plc program go offline it is done now. Thank you.